Hey guys, what's going on? Uh, I was removing a broken bolt and I uh, figured I would share this with you all on how I remove a lot of my broken bolts. Uh, it's on a bumper. As you can see, that one's broken off. That one was, and that's how I removed it. What I do is I take a nut, like so, weld it to the back end. First, you got to take a file. And make sure you get a good clean place for a ground. This one's going to be a little bit harder because it's not as exposed, but I'll set the camera up and show you how I do it. Okay. Camera set up. Uh, on this one, I'm going to have to take a pair of vice grips. Usually, if it's got, well, I don't know. Nope, that one will hold. Uh, if it's got a little bit sticking out, you can take a bolt and screw onto it. I don't know if this one's going to work or not because it's hasn't got uh, a lot of the head sticking out. So you crank up your welder. And the heat from the welder loosens the bolt up, or the stud up, as it goes on. Now let me see if I can get this around here. You just want to go in and weld the inside of it. while it's still really hot see if you can get and then you just back it off as you can see that one didn't weld all the way on the inside so you need to find another bolt uh, crank the welder up a whole lot hotter camera camera had a little fall there oh, shit. burnt my arm all right glowing red hot see if that'll fit Looks like it's coming. It's coming off there. It's just that socket's extremely hot. And there you go. Second one's out. And that's how you extract a bolt, broken bolt using a welder. Uh, don't always work the first time, but usually works. As always, thanks for watching.